Royal fans are speculating that Princess Beatrice and Eduardo Mazzi will follow in the footsteps of Kate Middleton and Prince William when it comes to starting a family. According to Express, punters believe the time between Princess Beatrice's wedding and her first pregnancy announcement will match the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's timeline. The royal couple announced they were expecting their first child, Prince George, in December 2012. The gap between their wedding and the royal baby announcement was seven months. Express reported that while a date is yet to be set for Princess Beatrice and Edo's wedding, many expect them to wait until spring for fairer weather. Bookmaker company Coral Tips 2021 is the most likely year that the couple will announce their baby news. Everybody is excited for another royal wedding next year and it might not be too long until Princess Beatrice and her fiancé Eduardo Mazzi start a family, choral spokesman Harry Aitken had told the publication. We make 2021 the favorite in our market for the year their first child is born. By comparison, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry announced they were expecting their son Archie just five months after their royal wedding in May 2018. The news of Meghan's pregnancy was revealed while the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were on a royal tour of Australia in October 2018. In an emotional moment at the Well Child Awards on Tuesday, Prince Harry appeared to choke up after discussing becoming a father in a speech. Last year when my wife and I attended we knew that we were expecting our first child, no one else knew, but we did. Harry said, recalling how he knew Meghan was pregnant with his son Archie at last year's Well Child Awards. I remember squeezing Meghan's hand so tight during the awards and both of us thinking what it would be like to be parents one day and more so what it would be like to protect and help our child should they be born with immediate challenges or become unwell over time, he added. Princess Beatrice is the focus of royal wedding fever as she prepares to tie the knot next year. Royal fans are already speculating on when she and husband-to-be Eduardo will start a family, one major sign suggests B will follow Kate Middleton's lead. Princess Beatrice, 31, will become a stepmother when she marries Italian property tycoon Eduardo Mazzi. Edo has a two-year-old son, Wolfie, with ex-fiancé Dara Huang. B will no doubt make a splendid stepmother and is already said to be close to Wolfie. However, Royal fans can't wait for her and Ado to start a family of their own. A date is yet to be set for Beatrice and Ado's wedding but many expect they will wait until spring for fairer weather. A springtime wedding would see B and Ado follow recent royal wedding trends. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry tied the knot on May 19, 2018, and Prince William and Kate, Duchess of Cambridge married on April 29, 2011. Hunters seem to believe the gap between Beatrice's big day and a pregnancy announcement will mirror Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge. Prince William and Kate announced they were expecting their first child, George, in December 2012, seven months after their big day. Coral Tips 2021 The most likely year for Princess Beatrice to announce baby news. Coral spokesman Harry Aitken had said, Everybody is excited for another royal wedding next year and it might not be too long until Princess Beatrice and her fiancé Eduardo Mazzi Mazzi start a family. We make 2021 the favorite in our market for the year their first child is born. His voice cracked and he lost composure for a moment while speaking at the annual Well Child Awards in central London. Harry described how at the same event one year before he and Meghan had first known they were expecting Archie. Prince Harry began, last year when my wife and I attended we knew we were expecting our first child and no one else did at the time, but we did. He then broke down, with host Gavi Rosslyn stepping in to give him a reassuring touch on the arm before he regained composure. Harry continued. Sorry. I remember squeezing Meghan's hand so tight throughout the awards and both of us were wondering what it would be like to be parents one day. And more so, what it would be like to do everything we could to help our child, should they be born with immediate challenges or become unwell over time. And now, as parents, being here and speaking to all of you, pulls at my heartstrings in a way I could ever have understood until I had a child of my own.